Hello everyone, welcome to another video from Studio Yorktown. In today's video, I'm gonna show you a very quick tip to improve the depth and realism of your business card markup. So let's jump right in. I'm gonna open up our Mercado business template. I'm gonna change the background color to something. Um, let's try a blue. Let's make this upper card color something a bit warmer, like uh, maybe an orange like that. Let's change this lower color to maybe a red, maybe a little bit lighter. Okay, great. So what I've done is I've already brought in one of our um, overlays, our Kesha overlays. I'm going to switch that on. When you bring in an overlay by default, it's going to be in uh, normal mode. What we need to do is switch that to linear light mode. And as you can see, that uh, that brings the overlay over our our image. I'm going to open up the levels tab because I think this is a little bit dark. So I'm just going to shift uh, the output levels here until it is a little less severe. Something like that. Click OK. Now, as you'll see, the light shaft which is coming over the mockup, it looks, it's an improvement over what we had before, but it looks a little bit flat because in real life, light would actually bend around this object. So we're left with an image that looks a little bit two-dimensional and it doesn't look like the light is reacting with the rest of the image. It's a very simple way to fix this. What we do is uh, with the overlay layer selected, let's click and drag over the areas of the card like so. Then we go up to filter, we go to other, and we go to offset. Now what we want to do is we want to offset either vertically or horizontally and we want to make sure that repeat edge pixels is clicked on. We click on that and we just drag a little bit to give the illusion of the light warping over the object like so. So then with a little, a couple of clicks we've got a much more realistic looking image and that has added some depth to the image. We are going to try that again with uh, a Madara overlay. So let's change this to linear light. I just want to make this pop a little bit more. So I'm going to open up the levels tab and I'm going to drag the input levels just to make the lighter areas lighter and the dark areas a bit darker so that we have a little bit more of a contrast. I think that helps a little bit. We're going to do the same thing. I'm going to click and drag over the top surface of the business cards. I'm going to go up to filter, other, offset. Offset it by however many pixels you feel comfortable with. I'm going to do 45. You could do it horizontally as well. So let's have a look at that 45, just a little bit, just so that when we click this off, it looks as though um, it looks as though the light is wrapping around your objects. So that's it. Um, hopefully you can try that out. Let me know how that works out for you. Thank you for listening to our tutorial and hope to catch you in the next one.